Uh, yeah, I think, you know, the last Final Four, the last four teams, you know, everybody want to win. Regardless of how you got there, you know, you got there for a reason. They had to be doing something right. So, you know, we're going to approach it as a, you know, a big team. We, do, we know who we are and we know what we have to do to win the game. So, if it, it comes down to we win or lose by one point, you know, a win is a win. We got one goal right now, and that's to try and win the national championship. That's, I think that's the thing that's on everybody's mind. You know, but I think so every year a coach is doing his best job. You know, he's going to try and pull the – the itty bitty, you know, anything out of everybody. You're going to try and get the last little bit you got. You know, you could be tongue hanging out your mouth dying. You know, he's still going to try and get a little bit more out of you. And I think that's what makes him special at this time. Kay, he, he helped us in the beginning, you know, get the, get the tournament run going. And just to see him go down, you know, that hurts us. But at the same time, we still, you know, he's not gone from the program, you know, so he's still here and we're rallying around him. And we, we got to the Final Four for him and we're going to try and win it for him. You know, it's a little different not having my best friend to my side, but at the same time, he's still on the bench. He's still, you know, helping. And whatever he sees, he might tell me, you know, real, do this or do that. And, you know, we still kind of got that partnership. He's, he's not actually on the court, but he's still a big help to the team. Um, you know, I think injuries just happen. You know, you can't really predict that. And when they do happen, I think we got such a versatile team. I think different guys can step up and, and play bigger roles. So I think... You know, Luce is doing a great job. You know, it's not easy to step in and run a team at, at tournament time. You know, that's kind of, kind of, it's very hard to do. And he, I think he handled it well. He had a couple mistakes, you know, but we all have his back and we supporting him to do his best. I think he's been successful. You know, Corey, he got hurt, you know, for a little guy. He got a lot of grit and toughness, you know, regardless of what position he put in. You know, he's going to try his best, you know, to do the best he can. And he got a, a great team and coaching staff around him. You know, we supporting him. When we see him getting dogged or he turned the ball over, we're not just down him like, oh, he out here messing up. You know, we're trying to pick him up and, you know, help him. Say maybe you could have got him off this way or that way, just helping him. And, you know, that's just helping build his confidence up. Regardless of, uh, you know, who's on the floor, I'm confident in everybody on the team. You know, so if one guy goes down, I think we got guys that can step up and get the job done. Yeah, I think I'm very confident shooting the ball, you know. I've just been in here working every day and, that helps build your confidence in the game. It starts in practice, and I think the last few practices I've had, I've pretty much been trying to make every shot, you know, and I haven't missed too many. That's just been helping build my confidence. I think every shot going in, you know, you got to have that confidence, regardless if it go in or not. You just got to have that, I guess, that swagger about yourself. You got to just feel everything is going in. You're not going to make a mistake, which you are. But I think that just helps you bounce back when you do make mistakes. Yeah, I think guys are just looking for me more, you know, and I've just been trying to move without the ball. When I do have the ball, I'm trying to be aggressive. And I think, you know, just making quick cuts and just reading the defense to help me get open a little better.